welcome to day 20 day suggest flying like that and we can see in our world every day we are growing centimeter by centimeter inch by inch feet by feet correct and today's verse is a very very simple one but very difficult to follow to put it into practice the verse goes like this सदा सर्वदा प्रीति रामी धरावी दुखाचे स्वये सांडी जीवी करावी देहे दुखते सुख मानीत जावे विवेके सदा सस्वरूपी भरावे तो दे हालमार्क इज स्वस्वरूपी स्वस्वरूपी दैट इज द हाईएस्ट इंपॉर्टेंस बिकॉज़ वी ऑल लिव इन आर्टिफिशियल डुप्लीकेट हिपोक्रेटिकल लाइफ हियर इट इज स्वस्वरूपी वंस बोर्न टू स्टाइल और लाइफ सो हियर द फर्स्ट लाइन यू सी इट इज सदा Sarvada is a he is using these adjectives twice in most of the poetry things sada sarvada what preeti all self explanatory ramim dhara bhi se sada always sarvada at all times preeti love ramim towards ram dhara vi hold he says hold on to love towards ram always at any given point of time in the sense what in the sense have a ram altar in front of you or a photograph or a calendar cut that to appropriate shape frame it put it on to the wall or have a ram photo hug to yours your heart and use all the foul languages against everybody keep shouting at everyone mm-hmm. the other day we have seen ram he is omnipresent and omnipotent so we leave the second but is only present all to the sky everywhere even in the smallest and the biggest there is no entity without ram in this cosmos so now here when we say love ram it says love everything everything that comes in front of you that is with you that is in front of you that is behind you that is towards your right and left up and down my boss sir but for everybody else he tortures me to the core are mere bahu na kabhi bhi kuch bhi sunta nahi usse kaise prem karu oh my daughter in law ha If you love Ram, then that Ram is in her heart. Also, we have done that heart meditation. See that Ram in her, and see how you can hate her. Always Ram of friends. When there is love, there is forgiving. You like a person, whatever they did, I'll be right. put a tick mark you don't like a person whatever they do it is only you find some fault or there we find fault only because of the personality not suiting us or the other things of course uh, some exceptions are always there if a child is trying to eat mud we stop yes some exceptions are there but love to be there always and punishability based on the act and remember there you are punishing 
for correction and no justifications here my dear friend lot of people they justify they do a mistake and after doing a mistake justifying that is a big sin accept the mistake so when you start to love like that what happens dukha chi swaye sandi jeevin karave so the woman do i say dukha chi we understand dukha is pain or grief swaye by oneself sandi removal jeev in one's heart karave that is what you are supposed to do once you start to love shri ram then there is no place in the heart for grief because love is so empowering and i tell you my dear friend especially nowadays with the youth with the children you know with their attitudes and behaviors with because of corona omicron whatever it is staying always at home getting glued either to the televisions or to the mobiles we don't know if they are attending an online class or if they are telling teacher with some lame excuse ma'am internet connection ma'am turn off the camera and start eating and keep roaming about in the house because they are all outstanding children you know they are outstanding always standing where outside the class it can be either in virtual or this thing shouting at them no i tell you they have to be molded in a loving manner not in a harsh manner that will not take us anywhere today it's all about love so once this ram is filled in every anu of our body in every cell of our body it should vibrate ram 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 like an ambulance silence ambulance says, wow 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 it says ram 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 the best example is hanuman so powerful he proves that the power is ram is more powerful than the arrow of ram then what you fill your heart with love and leaving no space for grief to settle in and you strive yourself in that particular fashion then what happens dehe dukkate sukamani ta jave then you don't look for the pleasure of the body and even pain you accept it as a pleasure as a gift of god for example you are having a small baby you are fondling the small baby the baby punches into your eye kicks on your chest and even at times they wet your clothes do you feel angry on the child on the baby so even the pain should be accepted with a smile body basically runs towards pleasure understand that spoils i see a lot of people who are all luxurious they are all health they are all not healthy and people who are striving they are very healthy during this period i see a lot of people sleeping on the floor they don't have a proper what you call roof on their head but they are healthy we are staying in vilas and bangalas we are stuck by cold because we are not doing that exercise properly body is not sweating that and we are in for trouble then what happens viveke sada swaswarupi bharave enrich yourself with the purity of this no strategies no schemings no plannings to gain something from others 
let there be inner purity filled with love compassion sympathy understanding giving than taking i tell you that is the best thing. so today they have again pointers as to how we should move or interact in the world with rama in our heart and seeing rama everywhere and accepting even grief as pleasure and to keep ourselves in our true nature because by default we are all pure consciousness this bodily afflictions make us egoistic you remove that you become one with the cosmic energy so with this we'll conclude today's session and thanks for being with kindly like subscribe and share with all like minded people